Well guys, this is going to be the first of a three-part series video up at the one and only Clear Lake in California. One of the most renowned bass fisheries in America. It is Monday night. Just worked a solid five days in a row. Made my way up here after work and I'm actually parked at my buddy Juan's house. You guys know Juan, part of the Dark Horse Division. I'm actually in the truck in his driveway. I will say this, Juan offered his couch to me, but I don't know, I'm kind of used to sleeping in my truck. It's comfortable for me. Just having a place to park and a place to sleep is uh, is fine by me, but it is Monday night. It's about 10 o'clock at night, and uh, the plan is to hit the water all of tomorrow, and then all of Wednesday. Supposedly good fishing here, so we should get on some fish. I think it should be an exciting series. We're gonna hope it is. I am going to get some rest, wake up super early tomorrow, and then Juan and I will be hitting the water tomorrow. Hopefully some awesome stuff happens and we can get on some fish. Stay tuned. All right, fresh coffee made, 5 a.m. Time to go fishing. Ready to go crush? Might as well try it. Last time I launched here, I think I had the Titan 13.5. <laughs> the famous Clear Lake. Man, this all looks so good. Just this grass already looks so good for a frog and everything, man. Alright, start here, clear leg day one, and we are going to, oh, I got a deep diving crankbait on, what am I thinking? Oh my gosh, it's not what was supposed to be on. Oh. <laughs> Chatterbait it is. Oh yeah, Clear Lake. Woo! Clear Lake, man, they're a different breed here. It's mean and nasty. Yeah, should have had a bunch by now, right? Whatever you think, man. Yeah, I'm game for whatever. Alright. Alright guys, we are making our way back into the slough. We did not have any success out on the main lake, so Juan, these fish gonna be here? No, oh, I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. A couple pelicans back here, that's a good sign, right? Yeah, definitely. back there. Knew it. <laughs> Look at that on the frog. Thank you, sir. Nice chunky. All right, maybe we just have to go back into this thick, nasty stuff to get them. Oh shoot, there's a bird chilling right there. Oh no. Dang it, I just got snagged up.
side. and a half four dude i threw it under that tree as soon as it hit the water <laughs> that's how they bend though they've been in the thickest like furthest cover you could get to i was gonna lip them i probably should have just swung them Got a big end. Yeah. Yeah, he's okay. Changed over to the jig and it paid off. something out here seeing a ton of fry oh look one just followed it out he ate it right there at the boat he ate it right at the boat wow they, they want the jig that's for sure all right this is what's doing the damage so far this is not the Kitech M2 football jig. This is a Strike King Hack Attack jig. We got the Blue Craw trailer on there. Nice thick weed guard, big stout hook, and uh, we're just flipping around. Oh, there's a big one right there. Oh my gosh. I'm talking. There's a four pounder right there. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. All right, as I was saying, there are tons of fry over here bigger fry so it's not like they just hatched swimming along the banks there's other little bait fish here but i think a lot of these fish they're coming out from underneath these canopies and they're uh they're following this jig they definitely want this i don't know if it like imitates a bluegill or what to them but it's uh it's it's a pattern i'm pretty confident that we'll be able to catch them like this So strong. Got a bunch of grass on him. Look at that one, ladies and gents. That's what we're looking for. Big old Clear Lake bass. I figured him out. Thank you, sir. Bite. 
good to go. It's like a little uh, obstacle course. Like if you finish, you get to eat. Oh, yeah. that's the goal. I need to eat. You ready to order? Just stand them up on your table. Let them know you're ready. <laughs> Well guys, it is about 2.30. Taking a little lunch break at the uh, the Boathouse restaurant here on Clear Lake. Today, a little slower than we thought, but uh, I don't know, why don't you go first? What would you figure out or not? Uh, not, uh, definitely. Bites I've been getting is on the chatterbait, uh, a couple on Senko. For me, I had to venture into the junk. I had to get way up into the trees, I had to throw way up under trees, throwing a jig around cover. I think a lot of the fish I, I was catching were buried under that grass under those trees. And mainly the frog and then the jig seemed to, to be pretty consistent for me. A couple on the chatter bait here and there, but uh, really had to work for these fish today. Didn't didn't come easy, but the nice thing is every time I swung the rod, it seemed to be a good fish and that's, that's what Clear Lake does. But anyways, we're gonna eat our lunch. This is part one of a three-part series, like I said. Next video uploads in three days and that video will be the remainder of today's fishing experience here at beautiful clear lake as always thank you guys for watching we'll catch you later Peace.